Good morning. Breakfast this morning is pancake and eggs and a croissant. The more space you can share the charge, the more stable its ductive effect. So in the case of size, the proton with Yeah. Yep. Resonance will always win out when we're talking about those. So resonance, so usually resonance is more important. We just finished Orgo. Walking over to the bus stop now. I'm going to my lab to image some fish. Good morning guys. I realized I never like opened up this vlog, but it's October 2nd. It's a Tuesday. Um, here I am taking you with me on another day in the life. I don't usually vlog on Thursdays, so I'm gonna try and mix it up. So today's Thursday, I did Orgo um, lecture. I just ended, it was from 8 a.m. to 9.15. And it's 9.15 right now. I'm going to wait for the bus at the bus stop. It's a very frothy 35 degrees outside Fahrenheit. Um, so yeah, it's a little chilly. Calf stretches while we wait for the bus. This is what lovely calm ab looks like. The bus made it. It's not, I made the bus, it's the bus made it because the bus is always late. We're on the bus on our way, chugga chugga choo choo. Made it to the med campus. I'm going straight to the fish facility instead of to my wet lab because three tanks of fish today. Um, we're just imaging the control fish and McCann fish and it will probably take me around like an hour maybe. I'm being, if I'm wishful thinking it'll probably be like 30-45 minutes but we'll see how fast I get these fish done. I'm also still carrying around this box. If you watch previous vlogs you know that I'm working on an engineering project for a class I'm in and today one of my, the people in my group and I are meeting up tonight to work on soldering and like assembly. So that's why I have this box with me. We change it to Crocs to protect the fish environment. And there we go. Yes. This is where I'll be for the next however long. grabbed the fish that I need today to image and yeah first I anesthetize the fish and then I'll just take pictures of them under the snow. So I'll be here for the next not sure how many minutes I'm doing these three times. I just finished one tank and Kavi just called me and said that um might want us to image three more tanks. So, but they're all only GFP, so they, they take a lot less time. Um, so I won't complain, but I'm working on my the start of my second tank right now. Um, it's currently 10. I have to leave at 11, which is perfect timing with where I'm on right now. And yeah. It's always a blast, right? Always a blast. We have one casualty. I just got told to image three more tanks. Um, these are like baby fish. Like baby, baby fish. I ended up not imaging those three tanks. I just sat there for a little bit and did two a lingo because I was waiting for um, one of my mentors to come help me, but then he never showed up. So um, I'm gonna do this tomorrow and I'm coming back to the uh, undergrad campus now. It's 11 o'clock. Look how pretty it looks. It looks a lot nicer than the undergrad campus, but the trees make it look like fall. I want to get back to the regular campus before 12 o'clock because I saw that I had class, but I wanted to go to physics office hours to check um, this week's physics worksheet concerns. And also, I did want to do the 
the last section of the very last problem. So I'm gonna go do that. That's why 11 o'clock is my bed. I didn't even, I didn't even realize that I wanted to go to office hours. I was just like, I have to leave at 11, but I literally forgot why I was gonna leave at 11. I'm gonna try and do some orgo homework on the bus if it's posted. Homework for this week isn't posted yet, so I can't do it. So I guess I'll just relax on the bus. I made it off the bus and I'm walking across the street to Metcalf to go to the physics office hours. To go over there. Back where I was this morning. I made it into Metcalf and we're walking over to the office hour. From, hopefully it's not busy. There's like 15 minutes of office hours that I've left, which is not what I was envisioning, but like that's enough time that I need to be able to figure this last problem out. Just finished up um, some <laughs> physics homework and I checked with a classmate, so I feel good about my answers now. And I'm now walking up the stairs, the same building with the big old green pipes um, to go to Orgo, at Orgo Lab. Prepping for lab. This is the lab procedure for this week. We're waiting for the IR, which is taking forever. Literally forever. We're waiting still. Except I can't read any of the words. Just finished up chem lab. Um, it was good. I need to finish the analysis for this lab. Probably do it today while it's like fresh in my memory. But I'm going to walk over to Marciano's to grab a quick bite first. Um, yeah, I love my lab team. He's like really funny. <laughs> he's like a good person, but he's also really funny, which makes it better. So I'm walking over to Marciano's to grab some lunch before I continue my work. Seeing the light of day again. Someone just said hi to me and I have no idea who they are, but... Yep, we're gonna walk to Marciano's. It's currently two o'clock. My next class is physics lecture, which is at five o'clock. So I have about three hours. I plan on spending these three hours quickly grabbing a bite, which is like 30 minutes. Then I'm going to finish the post lab for this lab, which is take me an hour maybe. And then I'm going to, let's see, I'll probably watch the chem pre-lecture videos for next week, which will take me 15 minutes. And then you can go. Oh, okay. <laughs> that was my professor. It's peak lunch hour, which is the worst time to come here, but. I'm gonna grab some food and then hopefully quickly eat and do some lunch. Today I'm having a salad, a really big salad. Um, uh, I think this is soy milk, um, chicken. I just got a variety of protein so that it covers the basis for my salad. I usually don't sit by the balcony, but it's kind of cool to watch people struggle up and down the stairs. I decided that I'm gonna watch the chem pre-lecture videos for next week while I eat. Um, which is perfect because usually like you can't fast forward them and you can only listen so I'll just watch them while I eat which is great The first video is on acid and bases finished this one um, Next one is on Those are from last week What was I doing? Next one's on nucleophils and electrophils. I just finished the second video and I'm on to molecular orbital theory. Alrighty, I just finished the videos for next week. I'm gonna check if the homework is posted. Oh, it's posted, all right. Perfect, so I'm gonna go back to my apartment now and we will do the homework and the post lab. For this week and or the post lab for this week and the homework for next week so it's perfect so it's three o'clock right now which is later than I thought it would be um, but I didn't like if I wasn't watching those videos I would have been done a while ago but because I 
decided to watch those videos, it took me some time to figure out the problems, like the post video problems. So, yeah. but we're well, looking back now. I definitely have like some of the aches and pains that like remind me of when I was training a lot in high school. But yeah, I went swimming yesterday. You can cue the clip, Sarah. Future Sarah editing. So I went swimming and I'm definitely feeling it today. Like my elbows and my shoulders just like crack, crack. It's like crackle, crackle, snap. But I don't like, you don't get sore when you swim, at least I don't. It's more like you feel like very overstretched. I didn't mention it in previous vlogs, but I live in South Campus, which is more like an apartment style and um, suite style place to live rather than the big freshman towers it's a little bit farther than the freshman towers like like 90 degrees to it, if you know what i mean like 90 degrees to come out but um i really like it there i didn't pick it there freshman year i picked to be in warren and i didn't get warren i got put in one of those apartment suites and it's a lot nicer and a lot quieter which i really enjoy I'm back on my side of the woods. This is kind of what South Campus looks more like. I live all the way down there. I made it inside. I always come through the basement. I feel like it's a shortcut, but it probably isn't. But this is like the common room area. But here we go, back home. Do you want to unpack my bag with me? Of course you do. First I have to take off this jacket though. It's like, they turn the heat on and it's really hot upstairs. So we have the windows open even though it's like 30 degrees outside. But this is what we have. I have my lab bag that I had today. I have my Orgo goggles, my chem lab coat, and that's it, so I'm gonna go hang it up. I then have my jacket. I have my planner, my physics notebook. I hadn't planned to come back to my apartment before my physics lecture, so that's why I brought this with me. Um, my mechanics book that I was doing my physics homework in. Um, my headphones, portable charger, stuff like that. That's okay. case. Um, my laptop. Oh, my pen. My laptop that I need to charge. Put that on the side. My charger. I found these things on Amazon. Um, they're like a wire organizer thing. Very helpful. Um, I have a banana that I didn't eat yet. And yeah, water. And then unpack my bag with me. I find that I'm the most efficient when I just get straight into work. So I'm going to do my chem post lab worksheet, which is in my engineering bin for some reason. Um, but so I have the IR of one compound. Um, I have the NMR of one compound. I have this is a worksheet that I need to fill out. Um, I have the IR of the other compound and the NMR of the other compound. And I have to figure out what these compounds are out of these structures. Um, and then I have to do some data analysis for solubility in the rules and stuff like that. And then I will turn it in and it'll be all done. So I estimate this will take me about an hour. We'll see. Last time I estimated that it was going to take me an hour to do the NMRs and it took me two hours. 
but this time it should be a little more efficient now that like I kind of know what I'm doing. So watch while I do my homework. It is now 4.43 and yes, I'm running late for class, but I did finish the worksheet. Um, I need a, I finished like the worksheet itself, but I annotated this um, IR and this NMR, but I still have to, oh wait, no, I finished this NMR. For the other NMR, I s this is the IR, I finished the IR, but I need to figure out um, resonance for these hydrogens to do that. So for now I just wrote times three, but I will label like each specific peak. But for now, I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna go get ready for class and I'll figure out that tonight. If anyone's looking for good candy, best candy ever. It's like so, so good. Best gummies, best candy ever. Anyways, now I'm going to class. It's 4.50. Obviously, I'm running late for class, but oh, it's stuck. okay. Um, but I'm gonna leave now. Where are my keys? Hold on, I gotta find my keys first. I'm literally ridiculous. I left. I left the keys in the door. That's how frazzled brain it was. Anyways, um, yeah, I'm off to physics lecture. I'm running a little bit late. Class starts at five and it's 4.55 at this point probably. But my friend's gonna save me a seat and it'll be all good because the first couple minutes of lecture are not very helpful anyways. So I'm going to run over and got my box. Um because my group mate and I are gonna work on this project after physics. Run. The crazy thing about fall is that it's early four or five and like the sun's already going down kind of. Yeah. Walking, I gotta get over to that building over there. But I can't fly sadly over the highway. So we gotta take the long route of walking. building all day like an orgo lecture in here an orgo lab i had physics office hours in here now i'm back for physics lecture it's all the way at the end of the hall but last class of the day We just finished physics and now we're going to EK210 office hours, which is where my box comes in handy that I've been lugging around all today. We made it in the freezing cold. We'll be here for the next time to work on this bad boy. First order of business is soldering our broken pulse sensor back together. <laughs> Our makeshift tape at 1 a.m. in the morning has done us good, but we need to fix. Look at Gordon go. Oh, bro, the fan is nowhere close. <laughs> Hooked it up. It's a soldering success. It now works again. Now to figure out this jumble. I just designed a new enclosure for the box. Office hours is wrapping up soon. Um, I just sent Gordon over to Epic and he's gonna print. Bye! Sorry, my friend just waved. Um, he just um, is printing this, cut, laser cutting it from acrylic. I need to order another part. Um, I need to order a hinge. But I'm trying to figure out what hinge to order. So, decisions, decisions. All my non engineering friends would laugh at how I'm nerding out over different types of hinges right now. <laughs> Our laser cut box stands by itself <laughs> we'll assemble the pieces next week but gordon did a very good job this is epic um 
where we do engineering projects. Oh, yeah, it's pretty cool. We're leaving now. We 3D printed our part. It was a success. Um, we just finished and we're walking to Warren to go eat dinner now. Oh my gosh. Okay. Dinner tonight, I'm having chicken tenders and waffle fries, some more General Gao's chicken that's probably rock solid. <laughs> and I did stir fry and bubbly. We're leaving. Going back to my apartment. Walking back home. Late. It's actually not that late. Around eight. I'm gonna go shower now. Showering. I'm going to work on some or I'm gonna finish the pre-lab or post lab that I that I basically finished before physics, but I need to just like freshen it up a little bit. I'm gonna say that I finished the post lab. I'm not gonna turn it in for now um, because I sent my professor an email about a question that I have and I'm waiting for her to respond back before I make a decision on some certain peaks for an MNR in MR in, in the MR MNR <laughs> um, but yeah now I'm gonna figure out this tab situation don't you worry but I'm gonna move on to writing the um, pre-lab for next week um, which is, whoa, this thing. So I'm gonna write down the procedure for this lab to prep for next week. This was this week's physics homework that I just turned in. So I can cross that off my to-do list. So, since sitting here, I did pre-lecture videos earlier while I was eating lunch, um, lab worksheet. I finished most of it, I emailed my professor. These two things I just did, um, I wrote down the lab procedure and I did the grade scope, uh, which is this thing for next week's lab. Um, and then I just went over my physics homework and I turned it in. So I, now I just have to do some orgo. It's 11.41. Um, I'm gonna go to bed soon, but I wanna start on this orgo homework. Of course I can't find it now. I gotta clean up my desktop or my downloads, but I'm gonna do like one or two questions and then we'll call it a day. I did the first question, not sure if I got it right, but I'm calling it a night, cause it's like 12. Exactly 12, look at me go. Like I said, it's 12 now, it's been a really fun and successful day. I'm not gonna lie, I got more than I thought I would get done today done. Um, so I'm gonna brush my teeth, See you guys soon, probably for another vlog. Bye!